North Dakota lawmakers voted in committee today to decriminalize small amounts of marijuana. Reporter Maddie Beer Temple has more on the legislation and whether North Dakota could be creeping closer to outright legislation. Some state legislators want to decriminalize marijuana. We don't want to create criminal records that are going to affect people into the future. Representative Shannon Roars Jones's bill passed in committee by a vote of eight to four. It makes possessing up to an ounce of marijuana a civil instead of criminal offense, which carries a lesser fine of $50 instead of the current infraction fine of up to $1,000. This is a good option that will um, provide us at least a, a, an initial step in the event that the legalization measure d does not pass. Roars Jones referenced another bill under consideration this session, 1420, that would legalize marijuana, which differs from the decriminalization this bill provides. There's also another piece of legislation that would put the legalization question up to voters in 2022 and then regulate the drug. The object is not to make it where there's no regulation whatsoever, uh, but the, the idea is to, uh, to, you know, say that this is a legal substance, but not that this is an unregulated legal substance. The committee shot down that resolution, which would have amended the Constitution by a vote of 10 to 2. The National Organization for the Reform of Marijuana Laws, or NORML, weighed in on both bills. Decriminalization would allow, you know, police and, and the courts to focus their resources on, you know, combating serious crime instead of, you know, otherwise law abiding citizens. State policies coordinator Carly Wolf says even if the bill doesn't pass, there are other ways for the state to support legalization. If lawmakers fail to act on these issues, then I think uh, voters will definitely take it into their own hands, as, as we've seen in previous years with with statewide ballot measures. There are currently nine bills under consideration in the legislature related to marijuana, medical or otherwise. Reporting in Bismarck for KX News, Maddie Beer Temple. So far, 15 states plus D.C. have legalized recreational marijuana. And now to our COVID-19 